Now let's look at editing customer accounts. I'm back on this customer list here, the customer through the invoicing module, customer tab. Here is the list of my customers. To look at a customer account, we simply just click on the customer. We're then taken to the customer account and the layout changes slightly. So going back to the customer list, this is how things look. When I click on a customer, we can see the customer account and our customer list minimizes and goes to the left here to create a second left hand sidebar. So we have our modules followed by the customer list. On this customer account, we can see payments and invoices on the customer account. We'll come back to this later on. There's currently nothing showing because nothing has been added, but don't get too concerned about that at the moment. What we're going to focus on in this video is editing customer details. Now clicking on the customer details within the customer record, you can see the details that have been added to the customer account. To edit these, including editing the name of the customer, you simply just click on the edit button. So let's go back and we'll go from the beginning. So let's say we want to change the bookkeeper master. Let's say they have a new phone number and we want to update that customer record. We click on the customer. We click edit. We're then taken back to the customer information screen, which is identical to the customer information screen when we add the customer. So it's all the same details showing with these same tabs. So let's put in the new phone number and click save. The phone number has now been updated and you can edit all the details of the customer. So let's edit this customer. This is the other customer we added in the previous video. If I click on this customer, I click on edit. Let's change the name here and change the company and the display name. We can go ahead and change even more details if we wanted to change the address, contact details, email address, add some notes, change tax info, the billing defaults, the language, the attachments. We can change anything we want to. Once we're happy, we click save and those details will be updated. So that's how you edit customer accounts. I'll speak to you in the next video.